Hello, hello, and welcome to Games Revisited. It's episode 14, and we're continuing our playthrough of Chrono Trigger. We just did a little detour back through the sewers, thanks to some uh, reminders of very helpful and useful content from the uh, YouTube comments. So if you haven't already, do subscribe to the YouTube channel. Definitely give me your quips, quotes, qualms, complaints, compliments, feedback, and other whatnot in the comments. I do check them out, and I do, I do appreciate it. And uh, so, now that we've uh, picked up a more powerful sword through the sewer, we're going to go through and start our, uh, start our questing through the derelict factory. There is a lot to do in here, and we're going to try to do it all. Because of course we are. So we've got two elevators over here. The one on the left will take you all the way to the end. So if you're trying to do the game in the, the short run where you get to the end of time before or at level nine, uh, which allows you one extra little fight of a guy that we'll talk about when we get to the end of time and allows you to earn one extra magic dab, uh, which is nice if you're really trying to power game it through. If you're trying to do a show where you breeze through the combat and chat as you go, uh, running short on levels does not help you get through quickly. So uh, we're going to run through and we're, I'm going to try to grind out between weeks and uh, that sort of thing. And I'm also going to fully explore items like this here, where we're going to head on through because there is a more powerful bow than what Marley currently has, and there's a more powerful gun than what Luca currently has, and there's all sorts of XP to be had on top of that. So let's go through here, and we'll start with... Oh, that's right. So that will let us go on up through there. Unless I can... Can I duck through there quick? Nope. Oh, hang on. I don't want to bump into the dude. Or maybe I don't care. Nah, let's try to do this where we don't bump into the dude. Go, 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 sprint. And what do we have here? An ether. Is it an ether bunny? I don't think she bumps into them. Okay, good. It's just the lead character. Sprint, sprint, sprint. And what do you got here? We got these guys. We'll just take care of them real quick. That ought to take care of them all, right? Yep, that took care of them all. And cool heroes don't look at deaths. You can tell by the way he's turned away. <laughs> Ooh, we got a panacea. Chrono's level increased. Robo's level increased. And you get a level. And you get a level. Alright. Enough of that silliness. Uh, that's right. We got a couple of those barrels that we need to move somehow. We've got this guy up here, which gets us a mid potion. As opposed to a Midgard. And that gets us a mid ether And 400 gold, which is always nice. And computer says, crane control codes. AA and YY. No, AB and YY. Abby. Um, ah, let's do the fight. Come on. Let's do this. Leroy? No. Wrong game. That's a different classic game. Oh, that didn't finish him off. How dare he survive that attack? He's supposed to wither under our, under the strength of our combined arms. Alright, let's uh Let's just try to do the cyclone, get some regular attacks in there. 
Yeah, I think that's going to get enough damage output to uh, finish that off. Yay! 120 gold. What's a robot doing with 120 gold? I don't know. I don't ask those questions. Well, I mean, technically I just did, but you know what I mean. Alright, so I got that barrel there, and that barrel there, and it's blocking me from all the other stuff, so... Where's my crane controls? Not in here. Oh, it's probably around the corner. Alright, and that gets us a shelter. Sing the uh, Rolling Stones tune to yourself if you would like. Just do it in a non-infringing way. <laughs> I won't sing it because I don't like copyright strikes. Alright, to activate the crane, wait for the tone and white flash, and then press any two. Okay. Let's try that again. Wait for the tone. There we go. There's our AB Alpha Bro, which will get that first barrel out the way in the most ponderous animation ever. And wait for the tone. And that should get rid of our second barrel. Eventually. Alright, so let's see. That got us through... I feel like I'm missing something. I mean, other than a... Ah, come on. Let's do this. As it run up and bunch them. Because reasons. Oh, that's right. I forgot that he's got the counterattack, so about half the time he should be doing a counterattack when they hit him. Yay! The battle's won. The gold is earned. And two more guys appeared? Alright, uh, let's do an aura whirl. Because a couple of us are low on health. Robo's pretty much fine, but Chrono and Marley are looking a little sad. So that should take care of that. And then they should be able to finish them off with just regular attacks instead of uh, cruising through all our magic points. And now I can cut across here. Go through here. And pick up a... Oh, that's the same sword I just picked up. Okay. You know what that is? That's money. Anytime you pick up a duplicate item, <laughs> that's money. In sword form. Ultra High Security Door Lock System Code. X-A-B-Y. <laughs> Ultra high security. As high security as one, two, three, four. Change all your codes, people. A, B, Y, X. Wait. Is it X, A, B, Y or A, B, Y, X? A, B, Y, X. Alright. Oh, 
I mean, it's still a counterclockwise circle of the buttons. Um, I feel like I'm missing something. Yeah, there should be a Robin bow around here somewhere. Is that over on this side? Bandit's bow. Sorry, Robin bow is the uh, classic version. <laughs> All right, so that's attack 20. That is attack 25. Yes, please. Okay, now. Now we've gotten everything that we need to get. I mean, unless we want to do some fights going through the uh, conveyor belt, which as much as I would for the XP, we're, uh, we're about halfway through the time I wanted to spend here anyway. Again, trying to keep a balance between uh, a detailed playthrough and a timely playthrough. All right, guys, let's do this. I'm not going to waste any text on you because you're a little too spread out. Zip. Of course, now they're standing next to each other. Get these guys to uh, heal up because a couple of people are looking sad. Don't tase me. And there he goes. Uh, magic and health are looking okay, so we'll go ahead and we'll uh, continue along. Yay, Marley's level increased. Ooh, here's the question. As much as I love having all the extra healing, especially given my absent-minded attention, do I want to hurry up and switch Marley out for Luca so I can get Luca's level up too? Um... Hmm. How many potions do I have? Got 21 potions. Uh, still healing too. Yeah. Let's try to keep the party in uh, parity. Oops, wrong way. But while I'm here... Restore your hit point and magic point? Yes, please. Oh, I shouldn't have used that shelter before the factory. I forgot that that thing was there. I curse my short attention span theater. <laughs> Guess you need my genius after all? Not really your genius so much as, uh... Oh, you're already at a le level 11. Ah, well, we're getting ready to pick up a new gun for her anyway, so, uh... Annie, get your gun. Luca, get your gun. Doesn't have quite the same ring. Alrighty, to the factory. We'll skip that fight again this time. Down, down to Goblin Town. Oh, nice. Let's go ahead and do a little save here in the Derelict Factory. And let's fight these critters. This should handle them pretty quick. <laughs> or maybe not. Will this one do it? Oof. 
Yikes. Um, did I misread their weakness? Hmm. There we go. <laughs> Punch him. Hey, Luca's level one up. And there's our shelter. Hatch opened. All right, down the hatch. Ooh. Um. Is this the way I wanted to go? Goes there to Q. Okay. Yep. Nope. This is the the inevitable way through. Try to knock these guys out quick. Two hit points at a time. I guess that's what we get for fighting oozes, right? Get them. Finish them. Alright. No point in wasting uh, magic points on techs for one one extra damage. Alright. Under 11 XP, 3 tech, 80 gold. And speaking of techs, let's go ahead and do the cure beam. Our laser shield. Titanium vest. Uh, so the iron suit has a defense of 25. The titanium vest has a defense of 32. Yes, please. Oops, while I'm thinking about it. Does Robo have... Robo already has a titanium vest. And Luca has the iron iron suit. All right, so we just got to get us another titanium vest somewhere, huh? And the hammer arm. All right, so let's go ahead. His tin arm has an attack of 20. Hammer arm has an attack of 25. Yes, please. It looks like the rest of that stuff is further down. Let's do this here. Tappity 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 tap. All systems down. Defense lasers deactivated. Uh oh. Critters ahoy. Let's try to get as many of those guys as we can. Yikes. Yeah, here it comes. Yep. Let's just double down on them real quick. Bam! Punch that slime in the face. I hate the way they keep moving around. Makes it hard to do the cyclone attack and get more than one of them at a time. Ooh. 
there. Alright, there we go. So far, so good. Although I gotta remember. Let's go ahead and use that cure beam to get everybody... Yeah, that's close enough. Alright, so far so good. And... Down we go. Oh. Up, down, cancel. Let us go. Alright, up will bring us back to the beginning. Down will take us down to the next spot. As much as I'd love to jump up to the save point and use the uh, shelter for magic points, we are rapidly approaching the the end of this part, if I remember correctly. Yeah. Ropo's magic's a little low, but... I've got... 30 magic points. 30. 30 is too much. Alright. Oh, wrong button. Inventory. We'll just use an ether to bring him up to 26 and 23. And that gets everybody at least close enough to full. Close enough for government work. Uh, ooh. Two, uh, two paths diverged in a wood. Which one was the one I wanted? You are... Oh. That takes us back up there. Okay. Good to know. So this is the way we need to go next. Let's go here. And here's the plasma gun. And he equip your gun. So that's an attack of 15. Yikes. Everybody's been hovering around 20. And picking up their 25. And that's only attack 15. There we go. <clears throat> and this one may inflict stop on robots, which is definitely useful. It's why this was... Uh... Oh, there we go. Yeah, that gun that inflicts stop is why um, V in the comment section... Uh, over on YouTube was recommending that I take Luca with me instead of Marley. Um, it was my intention to come down here with Marley, except I thought Luca was further behind on levels. And I am really am tempted to bring Marley back anyway. But um, we're rapidly approaching the... Uh... Oh no. What happened? Running around. That helps. <laughs> Emergency. The security systems have gone haywire. We must escape immediately. <laughs> Mad dash through the door. Hurry, before it's too late. There we go. Emergency alert status. Elevators disabled. That's right. That's why there were ladders up to every little bit. Couldn't remember why. Alright, so that means that elevator is disabled too. And that forces us to go this way where bad things are about to happen. These guys. Wait! These are my friends. It's good to see you again. I'm not reading model numbers. Bam! What are you doing? You are defective. You are not one of us. One of us. One of us. No. <laughs> Pardon? I am malfunctioning. Affirmative. A defect? I am a 
defect? Have you forgotten our assigned task? All intruders must be eliminated. That was the reason for my creation? You disgrace our series. You must be destroyed. I mean, we're one exterminate away from a Doctor Who villain. No, stop. And they're going to tackle him to death. Go ahead, pick your favorite football team and make fun of American football. Please stop, please. Oh no, they killed Robo. I should have named him Kenny. And they're about to kick him in the trash compactor, right? Yep. <laughs> All right. Bring it. Now we shall eliminate the intruders. No, I think the intruders will eliminate you. No, Mr. Bond, I expect you to die. Come on, Luca. Get your head in the game. I need a combo. I need a combo. Preferably before they knock me out. Combo. Fire whirl. Oop. Doggone it. I meant to get the middle guy. Oh, that's what I get for messing up a fire whirl. Alright, combo. Fire whirl. There we go. If I survive long enough. This is why I wanted Marley. Take that. Yeah, I think the next round is going to have to be a series of potions to get everybody back up. Well, I don't know. If these guys keep provoking counterattacks like that, it might not matter. Because <laughs> that's two of them limited just with uh, counterattacks. Yay for attacks of opportunity. Oh, 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 no. And, okay. Not too bad. Item. Potion. Chrono. Yeah, I was hoping for more. Combo. Fire Whirl. Oh. <laughs> I guess I didn't really need to unleash the combo on him like that, but uh, here we are. Might as well burn those magic points. Literally. And item. Potion. Nope, not tech. Item. Potion. Tech. Wind slash. Never mind. The counterattack got him. Yay! XP. Levels. Robo. I see him. He got stuck. He's fat. Oh, wait, no. That's my dog. They really thrashed him. I'm not sure I can fix this. Let's get him back to Protodome for now. Is this like watching uh, two PCs in D&D try to drag a Warforged off the field of battle to be healed later? Can you fix me? <laughs> yeah, I thought you'd like that one. Shh, don't try to talk. You're trying to change the world I don't know how far we'll get but that's the plan anyway Robo what do you want to do after I'm finished repairing you what do I what do I want to do yeah I mean you're stuck here all this time there must be a lot of things you want to do right no one has ever asked me that before leaping and fixing and time passes Good morning. Robo, thank goodness you're all right. Luca, you're incredible. Well, let's hope I never have to do that again, said the artificer. Luca, I have arrived at an answer to your question. I want to go with you. Really? You mean it? There's nothing left for me here. I want to help you. 
together we might be able to give the life on this planet a chance. Then let's go. The gate's right through there. Here we go. Except, before I hit the button, on that teaser, I am going to go back to the credits. And this is where I'm going to say thank you for joining along so far. If you're watching live on Twitch or Mixer, hang tight. There's still more to come. If you want to watch live, I stream on Thursdays, 6 p.m. U.S. Eastern. There's a link in the description below. If you haven't already, follow on Twitch or Mixer to get notified when I go live. And definitely subscribe to the YouTube channel. It helps the channel out and you'll get notified when new episodes and other content get posted. And um, the live stream happens each Thursday. I record six episodes and they trickle out throughout the next six days until we hit the live stream again. Rinse, repeat until we finish Chrono Trigger. If you've got any feedback on the format or on the shows themselves, definitely, definitely, definitely. Any quips, queries, quotes, quandaries, complaints, or other feedback, leave them in the comments on the YouTube video. So, live folks, give me a minute to prep the next episode. YouTube folks, I'll see you tomorrow.